Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. A live look from UW-Madison as the sun is rising on this Sunday, September 15th. A gorgeous start to the day. It is just a little bit later that sunrise than what we're used to as we continue to lose about three minutes of daylight every day. And the first day of fall officially is a week from today. Current temperatures this morning though, we're at 62 in Madison, 59 in Middleton, 64 in Janesville, Baraboo, Juneau, Boscobel, and Prairie du Chien. As we go through our day, I do expect a little more sunshine than yesterday. Staying warm, staying dry as well. The average high temperature for this time of year is quickly dropping. That's what it does during September. So the average is 73, but highs today, 15 or so degrees above that. With highs in the upper 80s, I have us at 88 in Madison, with potentially some of us hitting 90, which Janesville did hit 90 yesterday. So I do kind of expect that again as we go through today. So we've got a few clouds here and there. A couple of showers staying closer to Stevens point over towards northern Wisconsin to the central part of the state there. We're just seeing mostly to partly sunny skies through our day today. If you're closer to the Mississippi River, should see a little bit more sunshine, especially this morning as temperatures continue to climb well into the 80s. I'm also expecting partly sunny skies for Monday and then by Tuesday we should see more of that sunshine there and we'll track that as we go into a Wednesday, Thursday, most of this week as well. But new here this morning, your seven day estimated precipitation accumulation is growing, especially as you head a little bit further to the Mississippi River here. But I do expect rain chances to hold off until we head towards the end of this week here. Even Friday looks to stay fairly dry. It's by next weekend. First day of fall is Sunday. By Saturday, we could start to see a couple more of those showers roll in, which we need. We we. Thankfully, the spring and summer months set, a, set us up very well. We are at 35.91 inches of rain on the year. That's the sixth highest year to date total. And but in September so far, only 0 0.02 inches. That's two one hundredths. So we are well below average for the month of September for the season of fall so far. And that's starting to bring our drought back into play. About 47% of the state right now is abnormally dry. And if we don't see any more rain chances for a while, that could worsen. So we do need that rain. High temperatures are going to stay in the 80s this week. Low temperatures will be in the 50s and 60s.